Right, here we are, we're out once again on a nice calm day. A bit cloudy, but uh, it's meant to stay dry 90% of the time, so we'll find out. We'll soon find out. We're down at Brotty Ferry and the castle isn't open apparently. Unless it doesn't open on Sunday, but we're right at the side of the castle on what they call the Castle Green. Uh, down here we're, we're hoping for flounder, the dabs, uh, the usual criminals from the River Tay. Hmm. <laughs> flounder dab place. Uh, you'll maybe get cod, you'll possibly get pollock, you'll possibly get rats because I've had them around this weird this rock before, but they've been small, but all the same, pollock and rats are here. Uh, eels. A uh, common eel you can get here. I've had a few of them. Normally, off the other pier at this state of the tide, at low tide, you can get quite a few eels. Uh, so, and possibly a sea trout. And because it's Sunday, huh, you kind of keep it. Uh, so, that's it. No trout, no trout Sunday. No salmon Sunday either. No salmon any day of the week. So, and yes, you do need per a permit for trout and salmon. I uh, get asked, and yes, you do. Just for trout and salmon. Well, it ends on the 20th of October. Not long to buy it, and it doesn't last long. So, that's us. You get a beautiful scenic, scenic view of Dundee. Uh, uh, later on, when the tide comes in a bit, I'm expecting to see jet skis, yachts, Inflatables, all the toys of the day, uh, they normally come battering around here. I see Royalty Yacht Club, I've got a few yachts on the go, so they're not coming, having a competition because they come, they come right round this rock, uh, nearly up against this wall. Uh, it's not, not good at all, especially when you catch one or two of them. Uh, accidentally. <laughs> Right, so what are we going fishing with? We're going for fish, we're going with fish. So we've got mackerel. And because I was in the taco shop yesterday and didn't pick them up, we don't have bluey. Makes sense. Cat's got a new reel though, eh? we've not got bluey. So here we go. <laughs> we've got we're having a party. We've got these little squids. They call them party squids, and they're not uh, they're not very full of life today, I'm afraid. And we got I brought some sandals. You never know. A sandals, a sandal is bait. Uh, so we'll see what happens. And I am literally just off the beach, digging worms. These things, luggy worms. A pocket full of luggy worms. Well, quite a few luggy worms. If I can get a light in, you'll be able to see it. There you go. And we got some ragworm. They're, they're not that big, these ones. <laughs> I tell you, they're monsters. Some of them are quite big, actually. So, a few baits out of one worm, that's the stuff. As I say, st there's about 20 minutes or so to, uh, to low tide. Uh, the water's about, what, 20 yards away from the wall and it's rock and seaweed down there. Uh, so I'll hang about a wee while till the, the tide comes in a wee bit before I start fishing. Uh, we could be fishing along there, but I, oh, fuck, I'm happy sitting here and I want a coffee anyway. Yeah. I'm not myself without a coffee. Do you feel yourself? Not today. Not yet. Not since I was arrested. Huh? Uh, so, <laughs> so we'll get on and uh, get a coffee and then we'll get a look around. I would pre prefer to look from up there, but uh, since the castle's shut, we'll not be, not be doing that. You might be lucky. I don't know if they're still around yet. The dolphins. So... The three paddle boarders up through the I think uh, we've, got, we've got paddle boarders and quite a few of them. Jesus, the world is full of people in the water. No wonder fishermen can't get into it. Uh, 
We're going to have to buy fish tanks and just keep them in the back garden and fish on our own. Eh, that's how bad it's going to get. Okay, so let's get down, let's sit down, rest our weary ass at Inverness, as I say. But it's Brotty Ferry, so it'll be Brotty Ferry. And we'll get a coffee and get fishing in a wee while. Right, we've just moved along about 30 yards away from the castle wall uh, to, to fish in the water here. Because the, the tide's in a bit here, so you can actually fish. And fair good chance of getting eels out there. Uh, so we'll have a shot. Uh, eels and flounders mainly at this patch. So we'll see what happens. Yay! We'll get ourselves a fishy. And you'll be able to see it. Ain't that sweet? Right, there's... Been fishing for about 10 minutes, there's not a lot happening. Sitting watching ducks diving and swimming. <laughs> Great fun. So, here we are, Brighty Ferry. That's where we're actually, actually going to be fishing. Over there by the, by the castle, that's called the Castle Green. And that's called Brotty Ferry Castle. I don't know if you're picking it up on here, but I'm hearing bagpipes so inside the tune somewhere. Somebody playing bagpipes. The group down there, from, eh, fishing, family group. I thought we'd gone down that way myself, we probably should have fished off that first. But there you go. And we got a rock just off the off the side here. If you get a lot of wee pollock and wee rass and all that round about that uh, on the, the light fishing gear, LRF as it's known. I've done that before down there and eels, wee pollock, rasses and whatnot, other little fishes. It's nice. Across the water there is the town of Tapeport. That pier there is where uh, normally f normally fish just to the left of the five building. Uh, no, it's no, it's to the right actually. Just to the right of that five building, there's a pier, and that's where I normally fish when I'm over there. About there. It's not bad over there because you fish and there's good toilets up there and it's not bad parking spaces and uh, you've got plenty of bins for your rubbish. That's a good thing about it. That's Fife over there. An old lighthouse. There's another lighthouse just up there. That's a no bad area to fish over there too, uh, around the lighthouses. Uh, some rough ground, but you can get some decent fish out there, decent flounders and trout. And keep going, that's five, and then you're onto the Tay Road Bridge. You can see through the Tay Road Bridge, through the mist, the Tay Rail Bridge is at the back there. And that's Dundee. It's a bit misty today, actually. Oh, look, that's somebody's head. Oh, Jesus, that's caught. Always trying to get in the picture, eh? She's not even listening, I tell you, that's, in, that's how much interest she takes in me. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> There's a pier over there, that's actually the RNLI pier. Uh, it's got a lifeboat down there, and uh, you're not allowed onto that one. Uh, you, you do. There is a pier there that you can see just in front. Uh, you basically catch the same off the heat there as you do uh, over this side, and that is a bit rocky in that under there, but uh, it can be good, good for fish. Uh, it can be a pain in the arse as well because you get kids swimming and diving off of there. You get this whole area. Uh, you get jet skis, you get power boats, you get paddle boards, you get yachts. You, 
a whole load of stuff that can be an annoyance around here. Uh, at the back of that staircase, you can maybe see a green, green thing. That's actually a ramp on another pier, a wooden pier. That's a bit further back. So I've actually got maybe th three, there's three piers you can fish off, and one you can't. You go Brody Ferry. Got a lot of nice shops and that in there. This place can be busy during the summer. It's a summer vacation for people. They love to come here. A bit like Anstogon in that case. I have no idea what they're looking for. Probably stones. That's in the harbour itself. You can grab some bait in there. Muddy! You can sink in there as well. There's rocks and weedy bits. But not bad for finding crabs. Not all the time, but you can get them. And there's a play park over there for the children. So when you're fishing, you can throw the children in the play park and throw the wife or girlfriend up to the shops. You know. Fish in peace. I mean, what more could you ask for? There you go. That, that building at the back there, that's actually the, the old barracks where the soldiers used to stay when the castle was in in use. But it was for you for fighting off whoever planned invading Scotland via the Tay. And that's us. Uh, got a new sign up there that says no no jumping into the water and beware of strong currents. Ah oh, well I like raisins myself but there you go. So now we're back to here and we're sitting spectating on rods that are doing absolutely sod all. But we're waiting, we've patient people. We will get a fish. Maybe not now, maybe, but in the future we will get a fish. There we go. Nice flounder there. Nice wee size. Just come over from uh, the other side there and started fishing here about five minutes ago. So, good start. There we go. It's a while since I had one of these creatures. Nice eel. Oh, 
What make is that? It's a wee fly, isn't it? I don't know how we're going to stop it. The wind's over the hoops, the hoops through the fish. I can't get either of them up. Right, there we go. There's a nice little coal fish. Aye, aye, aye. No, it's not. Yeah, that is. A nice little coal fish. The hook was through the mouth, but the line of the other trace was actually round the hook. So it took the hook after it got tangled. Fun. I think Kaz got a fish here. Oh, eh? Got a pile of weed, but there's a fish in amongst all that. <laughs> Are you sure? Hold on. It looks like a fish to me. No, it is a fish. <laughs> fishy, fishy. Clean it up, make it look pretty for the camera. There you go. Oh. Cool fish. Right, oh. Oh, pretty cool fish. Hey. Yeah, nice one. <laughs> so she's not blank today anyway, she's caught a fish. <laughs> Got a monkey? Yeah. Oh, they're out there then. First cast about 100 yards. There we go. And I caught that within seconds out of hitting the water. That He's nice got another one. There we go. Macron, macron numero two. There we go. There's a nice, nice mackerel. They're going to be a bit bigger. Oh, yeah, I've got a fish. Oh, she has got a fish. Put the rod down a bit. It's just a wee one. Aye. Another wee one. Oh, shit. Shoot. It has dropped off, but this time there's no drains for it to disappear, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Bugger. Come here, you wee bugger. There it is. <laughs> there you go, there's a... It's like a... What's it? <laughs> it's like a coal fish. That is a coal fish. Right. <laughs> there. Coal fish. Right. Show you its clean side. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. There's another mackerel. That's four, I think. 
mm. just had the snap off and the uh, cat was in the mat and there's uh, very busy catching fishes. <laughs> She's got another cool fish. There you go. Here we go. Yet another little coal fish. Oh, that's a real wheel. Eh. Right. <coughs> there she goes. We're trying to not get it up. Oh, fuck. Wait a minute. <laughs> How lucky is that, I tell you. <laughs> Everybody else is chasing macro, you're getting caught. <laughs> well, here we here's something different. This is for that's what cat had trouble Phenomenal. pulling out. A, one, hey. one cod. Not too bad. Another cod. Half decent actually. Two cods on the one trace. <laughs> you, could, you couldn't make that up. <laughs> oh, it's bleeding. Foul hoot. But it still counts. It's another marker on the for the count. Yep. Cross lines, lines and key rings, everything. Still on my mackerel. Upside down it maybe. There we go. Untangle them. There's cat fighting. Mainly with weed I think. But you never know. I just reeled in my bait, it baited up rod and the whole pile of weed are in and the weed seems to be building up. Come on, let us see a fishy get. Why? <laughs> right. There. I thought it was some fech for a wee fish. Ah, uh, there you go. <laughs> Not worth the effort, is it? <laughs> it's your fish. A small fish, it's yours. 
stuff. Yeah, we've got quite a few folk actually fishing along the pier tonight. It's not often you see there's many people fishing. But, uh, yeah. Some on this pier, some on the other pier. Welcome to the world of the monkey hunter. <laughs> but we're still using bait and now and again go for the monkeys. So keeping, trying to keep busy. There we go. <coughs> oh, I think she's into something heavy this time, eh? <laughs> some heavy, some of these big heavy fish. Heavy seaweed, really. Must be three pound, that, eh? Ounces. <laughs> Go on, the, the crowds are waiting for this fish to be pulled up with three pounder. <coughs> so what? But no, walk forward a bit. Don't you let the line drag against a wall? You'll just cut it. <coughs> Pull it in. That's it. Fight with it. <laughs> Don't give it an inch, it will escape if you do. A big thing like that, you can't let it escape. <laughs> a big thing. Seaweed's bigger than it. Well, you've got a point, but hey. There it is. I'll hold it up since you've since it's a bit hard for you to do that. There we go. Oh. <laughs> Was it living? Yeah, it's living and I'm hooked. Oh thank you. Ah! What's that? There's a rust. <laughs> oh, Jesus. We must be catching every species a day. There we go. There's a ball, uh, ball and rust. <laughs> that is unusual. Well, not really. I've had one or two, but just wee ones. Not had one that big. <laughs> There we go, another wee cool fish. They're fighters, I tell you. Yeah, right. Catch two quads. Might be a bit smaller, but hey. There we go. One little codling. And oh, if I can get a hold of it, another little codling, only slightly bigger. Yeah, see, I could catch two cod too. <laughs> ah, well. That's better. Nah. That's another little cool fish. Well, it's a bit bigger than the others, so... It feels pretty warm, actually. Right. That's all. Well, that's it. Last catch of the night. Oh. A crabby creature. Well, it was a crabby creature. <laughs> <laughs> There we go, a little crabby creature. Had to catch one eventually. <laughs> I might. Right. 
<laughs> that's eight, of, eight o'clock, that's just finished. Hey, uh, and it's just about half past, just after half past, eh, uh, twenty past one or something. Eh, uh, well, I've had a flounder and one eel, three cod, two coalfish, five mackerel, and a ass. Eh, uh, cat's had two cod and five coalfish. So, uh, all in all, that's not bad. That's one, two, three. That's six species. Ah! We just came out to go fishing and found six. Find ourselves six species. Good stuff. So, and most of them were caught in the worms. So I'm glad I dug the worms. Because they got all, because they got all the fish. And so, from me, from Cat, you talking? Tight line. You're, you're not on camera. Tight lines. I should say in the black. <laughs> Until next time, enjoy this video and bearing about soon. Tight lines. <laughs>